Meghan Markle and Kate, Duchess of Cambridge have united and released a joint statement after a horrific mass shooting which took place in New Zealand earlier today. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and Duke and Duchess of Sussex have released a statement stating evil can never defeat compassion and tolerance following a terror attack in New Zealand. In total 49 people lost their lives and 20 were seriously injured in two violent attacks at two New Zealand mosques during Friday prayers. New Zealand Prime Minister Jacinda Ardern has described the attack as an unprecedented act of violence and said it is one of New Zealand's darkest days. The joint message from Princes Harry and William and wives Meghan and Kate is for the friends and family of those who were killed in the attacks. Both the Cambridges and Sussexes have visited New Zealand on royal visits, and paid tribute to the warm, open-hearted and generous spirit that is core to its remarkable people. The full statement reads, Our hearts go out to the families and friends of the people who lost their lives in the devastating attack in Christchurch. We have all been fortunate to spend time in Christchurch and have felt the warm, open-hearted and generous spirit that is core to its remarkable people. No person should ever have to fear attending a sacred place of worship. This senseless attack is an affront to the people of Christchurch and New Zealand, and the broader Muslim community. It is a horrifying assault on a way of life that embodies decency, community, and friendship. We know that from this devastation and deep mourning, the people of New Zealand will unite to show that such evil can never defeat compassion and tolerance. We send our thoughts and prayers to everyone in New Zealand today. Kia koha. Kia koha is a Maori phrase used by New Zealanders and means stay strong. The Queen has also released a statement, on behalf of herself and her husband the Duke of Edinburgh, saying, I have been deeply saddened by the appalling events in Christchurch today. Prince Philip and I send our condolences to the families and friends of those who have lost their lives. Her Majesty continued, I also pay tribute to the emergency services and volunteers who are providing support to those who have been injured. At this tragic time, my thoughts and prayers are with all New Zealanders. Elizabeth R. Prince Charles also sent his condolences, writing in a statement. Both my wife and I were utterly horrified to hear of the most barbaric attacks on two mosques in Christchurch, which resulted in the cruel and tragic loss of so many people's lives. It is beyond all belief that so many should have been killed and injured at their place of worship and our most special and heartfelt sympathy goes out to all the families and loved ones of those who have lost their lives. This appalling atrocity is an assault on all of us who cherish religious freedom, tolerance, compassion and community. I know that the people of New Zealand will never allow hate and division to triumph over these things they hold dear. Our thoughts and prayers are with the victims' families, the first responders, the people of Christchurch and all New Zealanders at this most heartbreaking of times.